Introducing MetricStream M7 IT risk management application for high-performing organizations with a user experience that is engaging, efficient, and personalized, helping you simplify and strengthen your cybersecurity management program. The MetricStream IT risk management application provides an end-to-end -end risk management solution for assessing and managing the risks across IT processes and assets in a scalable and repeatable fashion. The application enables risk assessors to configure specific factors and risk calculation algorithms to measure the inherent risk, control effectiveness, and residual risk. MetricStream issue management enables users to manage all the issues arising out of the risk assessment process in a centralized repository and track their statuses and closure on a dashboard. The risk manager can create and configure the qualitative and quantitative risk factors and subfactors for inherent risk assessment. A drag and drop risk scoring algorithm editor is available to define the formulas for risk assessment. Factors and subfactors can be defined to support methodologies such as DREAD and STRIDE. Setting up a risk assessment plan is a snap. You can choose a risk perspective, add assessable items that you'd like to be assessed, including their risks, choose who should be conducting the assessment, who will be approving that assessment or the results of the assessment, and when that assessment should be triggered, weekly, monthly, quarterly, or maybe just on a specific date. Once a risk assessment plan is triggered, a task will appear in the assessor's inbox. In this case, we're looking at three different business processes that each have a risk that needs to be evaluated. So the risk assessor can go in, click on each of the risks here, and rate the inherent ratings as far as impact and likelihood, or in this case, using the DREAD methodology. The assessor can provide his or her input as far as the assessment for each of the risk factors. Once that's completed, he or she can move down below and then evaluate the effectiveness of the mitigating controls that are already linked to that risk. If, you, if the assessor needs to add additional controls, they can do that here. Now down below, the residual rating is automatically being calculated, and this is based on the risk scoring algorithm that is uh, associated with the plan that triggered this task. Heat map based reports are available to plot the risk assessments across both asset classes and organizational levels based on impact and likelihood. So let's wrap up again with the key reports available in the IT risk application. So with this dashboard, you'll be able to easily see your risk posture across your business processes, across your assets and asset classes. You'll be able to see open issues across your assets broken down by criticality, by status, rating, and priority. And as usual, these charts and reports and dashboards are interactive and you'll be able to export these out to share uh, with other individuals, uh, to include in PowerPoint presentations, um, and these can be emailed out as well.